Hi coders! As an introduction to Python, we are going to learn how to make a simple Mad Lib program today. The name Python does not refer to a snake. It's actually named after Monty Python, a British comedy group. In Scratch, you use blocks to create code. This was called Blockly. Python is truly a programming language. In Python, you are actually typing in commands. You can create so many things in Python. It's versatile and one of the more simple and accessible program languages to use. We are going to write our script, a series of commands, in the Python editor called idle. And then when you're done writing the commands, you run your program um, like this by going up to run, run module. And then this is called the Python shell. Um, this compiles all the code into something that the computer can understand. So let's start by uh, defining a function called madlib. So Python uses def and then a space um, for functions. And this function we're calling madlib. And you'll see it has parentheses and a colon at the end of it and then you indent. So everything in this function is indented. So we're going to start with a simple uh, print statement. I'm going to say print and then thank you for playing my Mad Lib game. So you'll see the statement that you want printed out for your player is in quotation marks with parentheses. And then you're going to name your different variables, the things that are going to be changing um, in this game. Uh, so I'm saying noun equals, and then this is how I get input from a user. I write input and then parentheses, quotation marks, please enter a noun. Um, whatever the answer is uh, becomes the variable for the noun, and that's your input. Um, and then we're going to do the same um, with these variables, verb, adverb, adjective. We write input and then parentheses, quotations, you know, please enter an ing verb or please enter an adverb. Many adverbs end in ly. Okay, when you're done, we're going to say print and we're actually, um, you want your story to print out then for your user. So anything that I want, you know, the part of the story that doesn't change, like over spring break, we had so much fun, I saw a... Uh, that's going to be in quotation marks and that will print every time. But then your variables will be separated by a plus sign um, or else they'll run all together. And then we just put our variables in. So um, I saw an adjective and a noun. You know, we did a lot of verb with an ing and I with an adverb. Hope we get to go back soon. So that's my simple Mad Lib. Now I've created this function, so now I have to put it down here because this is the function that I want the computer to uh, run. Um, so let's see how this works. Let's come over here um, to the shell and it says, please enter a noun. So I'm going to say mountain. And an ing verb, I'm going to say sightseeing. Adverb, sincerely. Adjective, majestic. And then I hit return and I get my, my little uh, Madlib story. Over spring break, we had so much fun. I saw Majestic Mountain. We also did a lot of sightseeing, and I sincerely hope we take another trip soon. Okay, I think you have enough information to start your own Python uh, Madlib program. Good luck.